the East Coast. Oh, look at that. I know it's really it is hard to believe slow moving system that's not going to get kicked east until a cold front moves through and that's the same front that's going to bring us a chance for a couple of showers as we head into Thursday. A little closer to home live Doppler 13 radar is clear. We had lots of sunshine today and temperatures in the 70s. We were technically a couple of degrees warmer than yesterday, officially making it to 72 in Indianapolis after a low of 41. But many areas north of Indianapolis this morning were in the 30s with some frost. So a nice rebound to 74 in Bedford, 71 currently in Indianapolis, 73 Carmel and Noblesville, and currently with sunshine we have 74 in Tipton. Close up view of downtown Indianapolis, not a cloud to be found from our camera here. 71 degrees, a light wind at 5, humidity still very low at 23%, although we're not going to be as low in terms of low temperatures overnight. We're technically up up a couple of degrees from this time yesterday. 24 hour temperature change. We're up two in Indianapolis, up two in Lafayette, five warmer in Kokomo and in Richmond, and we're up four in Muncie. Your Wednesday forecast is a warm one. Not quite as cold out the door, 47 at 8 a.m., 65 at lunchtime. Highs on Wednesday, mid 70s, and we're going to be back into the mid 70s on Thursday as well. Mention the cold front that's finally going to kick what's left of Ian off the East Coast. Well, that will impact central Indiana as we head into late Wednesday and Thursday. This is Thursday at 6 a.m. with Future Track 13. You can see a little bit of green showing up here. What that means, clouds, a slight rain chance. These are going to be few and far between, and most of us won't get any rain out of this uh, moisture-starved weather system. And it moves quickly off to the east. May get a couple of wraparound clouds or a spotty shower Thursday night and early Friday, but the big weather pattern change will come with a significant drop in temperature. We'll start Thursday with clouds, maybe a sprinkle or two around 51 at 8 a.m. mid 60s again at noon and again on Thursday in the mid 70s ahead of the big temperature drop. We're talking highs only in the 50s on Friday and Saturday. Coldest air of the season and the potential at least, especially Sunday morning because we're going to clear Saturday night into Sunday for widespread frost, if not a few locations getting the first freeze of the season. 